to start with exercise 1.4 of the chapter Rational Numbers. This exercise is based on the questions of division. Now let's see question number 1. In question number 1, first part we are having minus 3 upon 7 divided by 4. So this division ke sign ko hum log multiplication mein change kar denge by making a reciprocal. So minus 3 upon 7 into 1 upon 4. Iske niche question hai to 1 we can take aur division ko change kiya multiplication mein aur humne iska reciprocal kar diya. Ek baat ka dhyan rakhna hai aapko ki jiske pehle division ka sign laga hai hum uska reciprocal karenge, iska nahi karenge. Theek hai? So we are having 1 upon 4. Ab yahan pe kuch cancel out to 4 hi raha. So we will be having minus 3 upon 28 as answer. Now let's move to the second part of this question and here we are having 4 whole 5 upon 8 divided by minus 4 upon 9. So this is the first thing we can say. 4 into 8 that is 32. 37. 37 upon 8 into this will be changed to minus 9 upon 4. Here we can cancel out. So we will be having minus 3 3 3 upon 32 or is go on look improper form me the hour so we are going to change into the mixed form and that will be equals to minus 10 whole 13 upon 32 as answer now we are moving to the third part of the question number one and here we are having minus 8 upon 9 divided by minus 3 upon 5 so, here we will change this and this will be giving you minus 8 upon 9 into 5 upon minus 3. This minus minus cancel out and this reduce ho nahi So, we will be having 40 upon 27. Now, this can also be done as 1 whole 40 minus 27 that is 1, 3 and 2, 7 as answer. Now we will be doing question number 2. In question number 2, we have to state whether the statement is true or false. The first one is minus 9 upon 13 divided by 2 upon 7 is a rational number. Now we have two rational numbers and this is divided. This means the second number is 0. Hai. That's why it will be giving you a rational number as your answer. So the statement is true. Then we have this associative property to verify. Karne ke liye rahe. The associative property is follow. Nahi kar. Division doesn't follow associative property. That's why it is false. Then the third one. Third one is for the commutative property. Commutative property में A को B से divide करिए, B को A से divide करिए, answer same माना चाहिए था, but it's not possible for the case of division. So this is true क्योंकि यहाँ पे पहले से not equal का sign लगा हुआ है. और fourth part में भी associative property का ही है, but उसमें not equal to लगा है, so the statement is true. Now after this we'll be moving to question number three. In question number three we are having the product of two rational number is minus eleven upon twelve. If one of them is 2 whole 4 upon 9, find the number. So, here we have to find the number which when multiplied by 2 whole 4 by 9, you will be getting the product as minus 11 upon 12. So, let the required number be x and according to question, when x is multiplied by 2 whole 4 by 9, we are having the product is minus 11 upon 12. Ab, ये यहां पर मल्टीप्लाई हो रहा है तो दूसरी तरफ जाएगा तो डिवाइड हो जाएगा सबसे पहले इसको इंप्रॉपर फॉर्म में हम लोग कन्वर्ट करेंगे दैट विल बी गिविंग यू x 9 2 18 एंड 18 plus 4 minus 3 upon 8 as answer. Now in question number 4 we are having by what ratio number should minus 7 upon 12 be multiplied to get the product of 5 upon 40. So here let the required number be x and according to question we are having minus 7 upon 12 into x equals to 5 upon 40. So here for x we are going to Make a transpose of this and this will become 5 upon 14 into 12 upon minus 7. Here we reduce it. So 2, 6 are and 2, 7. And here we are having x equals to 30 upon minus 49 as answer. Now we are moving to question number 5. Here in question number 5 we have by what ratio number should minus 3 be divided to get 
minus 9 upon 13 as answer. Now let the required number be x and according to question we are having minus 3 divided by x equals to minus 9 upon 13. Because minus 3 ko x se divide karne bhe hume ye answer mil raha hai. Now this will be written as minus 3 into 1 upon x equals to minus 9 upon 13. Ab x ko upar karenge aur isko idhar. So here we are having minus 3 into 13 upon minus 9 equals to x upar jayega. And here we get x. Now this will reduce. Kar this will be giving you 3 minus a minus b cancel out. Therefore, this x is equal to 13 upon 3. This is in an improper form. So we will write it. x equals to 4 whole 1 by 3 as answer. Now let's do question number 6. Here in question number 6, we have divide the sum of minus 13 by 8 and 5 by 12 by their difference. So, first of all, we have to sum the two numbers, then we have to sum the difference, then we have to divide the two answers. Now, here the sum is minus 13 upon 8 plus 5 upon 12. So, first of all, we have to take the same of 8 and 12 will be 24. And 8, 3 times, so this will be equals to minus 39. Plus 3, 12, 2 times, so we will be having 10 over here. That is equals to minus 29 upon 24. This is our sum. Then the difference. Difference will be equals to minus 13 upon 8 minus 5 upon 12. And this will again having the LCM as 24. Or 8 3s are. So we will be having minus 39 minus 12 2s are. So this will be minus 10. And we have the same same as the so they will be added and this is equals to minus 4 9 upon 24. Then we have to find the quotient. The quotient means you have to divide this by this one. So the quotient we are having minus 2 9 upon 2 4 divided by minus 4 9 upon 2 4. And this will be equals to minus 2 9 upon 2 4 into 2, 4 upon minus 4, 9. This is cancelled out. 24 is cancelled by 24. And we are having 29 upon 49 as answer. Now we can do question number 7. In question number 7, we have divide the sum of 8 upon 3 and 4 upon 7 by the product of minus 3 upon 7 and 14 upon 9. We have to the sum of पहले दो नंबर का और फिर प्रोडक्ट निकालना है बाद के दोनों नंबर का और फिर जो दोनों के आंसर आ जाएंगे तो उनके आंसर से हमें क्वेश्चन निकालना है सो हियर वी हैव टू फाइंड द सम ऑफ 8 अपॉन 3 एंड 4 अपॉन 7 तो ये हो जाएगा हमारे पास द एलसीएम ऑफ 3 एंड 7 21 देन द टेबल ऑफ 3 वी गेट 21 एट अ 7 टाइम्स सो 8 इनटू 7 वी आर हैविंग 56 प्लस 7 टेबल में 21 आता है 3 टाइम्स में सो दिस इज 12 और इन दोनों का सम हो जाएगा 68 अपॉन 20 one. Then the product of these two. In the two product nikalna. So product me sabse pehle thee se cancel out ho jayega. Will be having two over here. Or ye bhi se cancel ho jayega. Will be having three. So minus one into two. That is equals to minus two upon three. Ye hamare pas product ho gaya. Then the quotient. Quotient we are having sixty eight upon twenty one. This one divided by minus 2 upon 3 that is equals to 68 upon 21 into 3 upon minus 2 this is cancelled to give you 7 or 2 say cancel okay you get 34 so we are having minus 34 upon 7 now we will change kar dete hain apne mixed form mein. and this will be written as minus 4 whole 6 upon 7 as answer Now we are moving to question number 8 and here we have to verify that division doesn't follow the associative property. Associative property ko division follow nahi karta. And for that we are having the value of P, Q and R. So now we are going to start with the LHS. Iske LHS se start karte hain. LHS we are having P divided by Q in a bracket divided by R. Now we place the value of P, Q and R. And here we have minus 3 upon 2 divided by 4 upon 5 in a bracket divided by minus 7 upon 12. Now, here the division ka sign is, so first we have to solve the bracket, so 3 upon 2 into 5 upon 4. Then, 
divided by this will be written as it is minus 7 upon 12. Here because reduce nahi ho hai. Agar reduce nahi ho hai, to we are going to just solve it. So minus 15 upon 8 ye ho gaya. Aur this division ko change karenge multiplication mein by writing it one as 12 upon minus 7. 4, 2 jar and 4, 3 jar. And here we have minus, minus we will cancel out ho jayega and we will be having 15 upon 3 that is 45, 45 upon 45 upon 2 into 7 that is 40. This we have got as the LHS. Now the RHS, RHS mein humare paas aara hai P divided by Q divided by R. Now we place the values of P, Q, R and again and this will be giving you minus 3 upon 2 divided by 4 upon 5 dividing minus 7 upon 12 in a bracket. Then we are going to solve the bracket first and here we will be having minus 3 upon 2 dividing 4 upon 5 into 12 upon minus 7. Yeah, because we cancel out name or and we will be left with minus 3 upon 2 dividing the product of these two that is 48 upon 5 into 7 that is minus 35. Then this division sign will be changed to multiplication by making a reciprocal of this number and we'll be having minus 3 upon 2 into minus 3 5 upon 4 8. Yaha par bhi 3 se 48 ko humlo reduce karenge and on reducing this number we'll be having 3 1 times and 16 times minus minus cancel out ho jayega and we'll be having 35 upon 2 into 16 that is 32. Now here we can see the LHS we have got 45 upon 14 whereas the RHS we are having 35 upon 2. So as LHS is not equal to RHS, hence verify. That's all for this video.